Yo, what I got so back here for another video of Batman the Animated Series 3. We got Season 2, Episode 10, Art of Steel Part 1, and Art of Steel Part 2, obviously. Last episode, we left off with the whole fiasco of, okay, Hugo Strange uh, basically stealing people's childhood where they did something bad or whatever, and then blackmailing them for it. One of them was a judge, and then Bruce Wayne interfered, and he's like, what was going on here? Last place you visited before this happened was a resort owned by Daggett. So that was already a red flag. And who was operating the resort? Hugo Strange. Another red flag. <laughs> he doesn't know that, but it's another one. He Bruce infiltrated. He was doing his best, but he went into the machine and it stole the identity of Batman. That he is Batman. He's like, oh, well, I had to get that. I'm gonna get that back. But while that was happening, Hugo's like, nah, this is this is money making business. Smart. They try to sell it to Joker, Two Face, and Penguin. Criminals. And y'all get this. He met him in person. So, yep, so you can figure out how that worked out or ended out. But let's get into this thing. It's going to be able to appreciate it. Let's go. All the studios just. <laughs> what are they doing, huh? I wouldn't even grab it out. It's a bomb! No ID on any of this stuff. Weird, huh? What should we do with it? Uh, we'll worry about it tomorrow. It's late. I'm not gonna lie to you guys right now. I'm not gonna know who the villain is. How is the door locked from the inside? <laughs> Imagine all of this. What are they stealing? A coupon? <laughs> A floppy disk? I'm guessing some new technology or something. I mean, on the floppy disk, not floppy disk in general. You stay put, Mr. Wayne. Stay put? I don't think so. <laughs> Can't blame them. They tried their best. I hate that noise. Jesus, guys, wrap this up, because that noise is annoying. Not the... <laughs> yeah. Honestly, whoever built it, got to give them props for that. I wouldn't have thought of that. Where's Robin when you need him, man? When you don't need him, I get it, bad man. I know, I know. But I'm not just saying, like, efficiency wise, it'll just speed it up. You know? I do wish you wouldn't be so rough with your toys, Master Bruce. Yeah, yeah, Alfred. Lucius, what's up? Bad news, my friend. I got away with all the prototype protein silicon wafer chips from R&D. The design specs? Still safe in the computer, thank heaven. I'm talking about AI, artificial intelligence. The missing link between computers and human thought. Who would have known? We are right there, buddy. <laughs> hey, Batman, wait 20 years. Where could the thieves hope to sell this stuff? Beats me. Only other group researching AI on this coast is Carl Russell's team at Cybertron. I thought Russell was retired. Dad, you in here? Oops, bad timing. Barbara, come in. You've grown. No shot. Dad can't seem to pick me up at the airport without bringing him along. <laughs> yes, well, he knows the way better than I. <laughs> now, uh, give me a second. I'm going to go back to my car. I'm changing to a suit. Hell no. I found the criminal. 
Bruce Wayne. I'm so glad you called. It's been years. I heard about the theft of those chips, my boy. My boy. Better security. This achievement, my prototype AI. This is hard act. For what? Holographic, analytical, reciprocating, digital computer. Oh, that's cool. I, I start swing. I don't. No questions later. That's her. I would like to know, because <laughs> depending on what you say, I might move cities. Ah, oh, hell no. This is like that one thing, another Batman show I watched where Batman made the, like, the robot Dave. Like the robot that was made to be Batman, made by Batman. There wasn't time to get them from the Wayne Enterprises databanks. I'll try again tomorrow night. Some people in high places are becoming too curious about this operation. So I'm assuming homeboy here is not even uh, what to call the guy that was running the whole thing. He might not even be human. Yes. What is it? What the devil? I am a man of God. Dad, you okay? Were you outside? Your hand is like ice. I'm fine. So the girl was a robot. He's a robot. I'm assuming he's only made two. I knew what was stolen. So you'll try to squeeze some info from his assistant tonight. Well, squeeze may not be the best word. You dog. Not at all. We're just installing some new computer safeguards. Who the hell's playing that music? Well, I'll stay out of your way. By the way, is this supposed to be like Marilyn Monroe? After you. What if Bruce put a virus into the code so when they steal it and inject it, the co the virus erases everything? wetware chips that were stolen from my company. Care to tell me about that, Randa? I have to go out. Uh, call Alfred if you need anything. I'll be back soon. Oh, they've got the file, all right. How are these guys getting in here? I uploaded a decoy file here last night. The real design specs file is at my house. Randa? Yes? <laughs> the information... God damn it, don't be saying that out loud. I heard your voice, Miss Duane. Thought Master Bruce had returned. I thought you might enjoy a spot of tea. Now nah, this robot has to perish. Something wrong? No answer at the house. Wow. <laughs> First try. I've definitely found something. Bruce Wayne is Batman. God damn it. This data may be useful later. Master Bruce. Alfred, what happened? Where's Miss Duane? Forgive me, Master Bruce. I I can't imagine how, but I, I must have dozed off. He don't remember? What? So, I guess they he really did get hacked. I was really hoping like a little, little bit of me like and eh, maybe the back security will prevent anything. Why do I say bat security? Jeez. Uh, there's something wrong with my head. Bat security? But that was a that was a good first parter. In conclusion, let's shut down this robot ASAP. The guy that built this robot, let's jump him. And that's about it. Let's get into the second part. <laughs> oh Alfred, is is your time to shine, my boy? Or Bruce can show off. I mean, it is what it is. I've lost it. She may have left a clue I can use. She's only human. That's where you're wrong, man. That is where you're wrong. You wanted me, Commissioner? Go to Cybertron and see Randa Dwayne. She has something for you. 
But I already took a statement from that Rossum guy. They ain't involved. Do it, Lieutenant. Meet me at the Gotham Club in one hour. I will, Commissioner. And thanks for... <laughs> Obviously can't replicate humans fully yet. Duplicate processor has been used. I didn't authorize that. Oh, is yep. This is where he perishes. <laughs> no, it was a stupid idea. I gave you too much free will. It's time to change your program. Um, I can't even be surprised. I saw this coming like two miles away. No, Batman. I called you. I expected your father, Miss Gordon. That's why I called you. That man is not my father. What do you mean? Wow, you're so smart. Join the team. But I know he's not my father. I know I sound crazy, but I'm not. Whoever's downstairs now, it looks like Jim Gordon. Talks like him, but it's not him. Getting a little fresh air? Come, this one might actually be an improvement. Just saying. <laughs> Not so fast, Batman. Uh. 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 I've been like, yeah, you're not bullock. <laughs> For show. No, not the sign. Even if that was a real bullock, still the sign, guys. My father? I don't know. I'll find out tonight. Don't go home. Stay at a friend's house. Good evening, Bruce. I'm glad you could come. You're going to become a member of a very exclusive club tonight. I bet. I thought I already belonged to every exclusive club in Gotham. Huh? Ah. Come on, guys. We know he's Batman. <laughs> like, what are we doing here? That man, Bruce, changed quick. Damn, how high help were they? Not likely, Whoopi. Bullock went to Cybertron and a robot came back. Wanna bet Dad's there too? Barbara. I agree, let's go. You gotta get training somehow. That security system's crazy. Maybe have both sides with cameras going at counterclockwise so there's no openings, but that's just me. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. That was a trash can two seconds ago. Ms. Gordon, your skill at breaking and entering is impressive. Where did you learn those tricks? Thank you. Appreciate it. daughter doesn't get all her education in school. That looks like a pretty big robot. Oh, never mind. Oh, it was just two robots. <laughs> what is this plan? The plan was conceived by Carl Rossum when his young daughter was deactivated. Deactivated? 
crazy term. A vehicular accident. Afterwards, he decided to find a way to replace humans whose decisions can cost other human lives. But we're all capable of... Whoa, that's crazy. Never mind. <laughs> I was a little bit more off. This guy said replace humans without making bad decisions. Huh? I will keep them alive until I have learned enough. <laughs> You for sure got a lot to learn, my boy. <laughs> this is an all-star performance coming out of this man. Rescuing you, silly. Come on. Emergency. Emergency. She, no, she was a robot. You had to. Uh... Dad. Not Jim, bro. Why is it Jim? You couldn't build one of something like that for the rest of your robots. Get my father out of here. You're going back what in. You? Who I are you? Oh, that's my Batman. That's my hero. The plan has failed. Trash, ash, ash, ash. Sure, the investigation will prove exactly that. Are we for sure? Or like, for sure? Like, we first like, seriously come on. I sort of enjoyed it. Stop, boy. Let's go home. I am it. I am the knight. Great little two parter. Great. Uh, I want to say it's my favorite. I like that was decent. You know, decent Batman episode, like a seven. Solid seven, I would say. Uh, I didn't know the villain. Uh, it's just like kind of cliche kind of episode. So I can't really give it any higher. And it's like, come on, bro. You say you were going <laughs> to replace humans with robots that make better decisions. At some point, you didn't think that was going to go off the rails. Like, come on, man. I'm not even a genius, but I'm like, hmm, there might be a possibility this might happen. So let me at least put a fail safe. He didn't put no fail save. That man showed up. He's like, oh, okay, I'm about to rewire your programming. He's like, you should have did that beforehand. Because he's obviously going to try to stop you. Like, what are we doing here, man? I thought you were a genius. This is what kind of scares you just for the future, to be honest. Because <laughs> we're not far off this. Where we can almost have a whole cyborg with AI into it. AI in the last two years have gone crazy. And that's just the last two years. Imagine 10 years from now. No, we're, we're, oh. <laughs> Bro. It's fine because I'm being the problem of my life, ready to box it out for my life. So I, I'm kind of good. <laughs> I'm kind of safe, but we need to be careful on that. No joke. I'm not trying to see any of these robots trying to take over, man. As soon as I start hearing about it in the news about Elon Musk and his, his business, I'm like, yup, it's a wrap. <laughs> I'm going to roll in like 15 different karate classes, buy 10 EMP grenades. Can you even buy an EMP grenade? I don't know. For the end of days, I'm getting one though. Also guys, see, we got Barbara Gordon. Come on, now we getting the team together. We are getting the team together. Barbara Gordon, also, uh, it doesn't seem like she has training, but she's kind of decent, kind of decent. She didn't really do much this episode, but at least she was in this episode more than I thought she would be. Because I thought there was a show in the beginning, and then she's gone. <laughs> like, oh, here's a little Easter egg. And oh, they, they sprinkle her more throughout the story. I appreciate that, Jim Gordon. I am so sorry for you, my boy. They did you dirty so many times. Bullock, honestly, let's just say I didn't know it was a robot until the end. <laughs> That's something, everything there, that's something Bullock would do. The only thing is, that robot was stronger, so it kind of gave it away. But if they didn't show the previous scene where, like, they told Bullock to go at this dock or this place or whatever, and then just cut to this scene where we see Bullock do this, I, I wouldn't have thought that was out of character. 
I'd be like, Bullock, what are you doing? You. But then I would, I would question, I'm like, why is he so goddamn strong? He's probably a robot. <laughs> but it would have been in character for a little bit. So that's not a good look on you though, Bullock. Like, come on. This whole robot thing, whatever. Obviously not coming back. This man was shut down. And I don't think he had the brain capacity to send his conscious to another thing. Sad. Also, Alfred. I, come on. You guys attack Alfred too? Nah, he got two negatives. Of course we had to take that man down. Come on now. But good episode. Thanks for watching. I do appreciate it. Catch you guys next time for another video. Peace, peace, bye-bye. Have a great day. Got